Greetings and welcome to the Moringa Growers Co-op. I'm Kendrick Henry and we're here in Plant City, Florida at one of our grower locations. Here we have 50 Moringa trees planted in an orchard style and they're spaced out about 10-15 feet apart in between other fruit trees interspersed, intertwined, and incorporated into a full food forest orchard style operation that we've got going on with moringa trees and lots of food. I've been harvesting here for the last two weeks consistently every few days getting a few kilos a day on the racks to dry keeping up with orders that we have coming in at the moringagrowerscoop.org. A really great question that we had today actually was someone in Brooksville Flores, Floral City Inverness area saying that their neighbor has about 15 to 20 large moringa trees on their property but they're older retired they usually only use maybe about a kilo of the powder a year and so she was asking us if we'd be able to come up and harvest the trees and so I started talking to her about how we the co-op are the members the growers the harvesters that want to see this organization flourish and so with her help we told her that she could fulfill orders for the moringa growers co-op of course going through all the certifications going through the membership the training but we know her she's been a part of the cooperative for many many years she was a part of one of the first locations that we established even in downtown and she's been a part of the farm and so she knows moringa she knows how to harvest she knows how to dry it and she was saying that she could use some of her skills that she has to help the cooperative. And this is what we need. We need every single person that's growing the Moringa trees or wants to harvest or learn how to provide Moringa uh, in a powder form or a dried loosely form or in a product, uh, how to get it to that stage. And then also how to fulfill that order for the Moringa Growers Co-op website. So, we began to told her, tell her that she could harvest the greens, she could dry them, it doesn't have to happen all at once. You know, it, it could happen a few branches a day. If she can go over to her neighbor's house, harvest a couple branches, strip the leaves, dry it in a safe drying facility that we've um, actually told her how, how to dry it safely, then she could potentially supply the co-op after we've gone through all of the training and. Uh, lots of lots of paperwork there's just a lot of paperwork in the co-op and uh, and so to get everyone to be able to supply the co-op we have to get all kinds of information from everybody we have to make sure that's tested and so we have to get that location tested and uh, make sure everything is safe and uh, talk to the owner see what kind of level they want to be in the co-op like she said he, he may not want, even want to be in the co-op at any kind of capacity but it's up to the individuals like you myself to make sure none of this goes to waste and I think that was the point of the whole conversation that we had was we don't want to see anything go to waste so if you know of someone or has moringa trees yourself and are interested in supplying the moringa growers co-op I told her that she could act as a drop shipping center for when large orders come in so if there's a kilo of powder order that comes in or a kilo of loose leaf order that comes in and she's in Inverness or Brooksville or Floral City area and the order comes in from that area she could potentially supply that order either deliver it or even just ship it right there and it's local and it was grown right there ultimately our goal is to ship moringa trees to the buyers from their most local areas and so if you're buying from California on the Moringa Growers Co-op website, we want to be able to supply you from Moringa that's in California. Of course, you'll have a choice if you want California Moringa, Florida Moringa, Philippines Moringa, Mexico Moringa, all those things when you place your order. It's just right now, mostly all the orders and everything is being supplied from right here in Tampa, Florida. So a lot of people are asking uh, if they can get Moringa from other places. And uh, that means that we need to get more sales, salespeople to help. We need to get more sales representatives to help us organize all these sales from other locations. So if you're interested, just like our friend up in Brooksville in joining the co-op and at least serving as a harvester, a grower, someone that can 
uh, fulfill orders from your location, uh, then please let us know. Please just apply to the moringagrowerscoop.org website. You can uh, put in your information there and we're starting to get uh, people contacting us every single day about how they can harvest for us or grow for us um, as members of the co-op. I was just here at this location a couple weeks ago um, and harvested these trees. So you saw the trees back there. They haven't been touched yet. And then these trees were harvested just two weeks ago. Look at the, the new growth coming off these trees. Just a couple weeks. Hey, buddy. And uh, yeah, so we've got some greens coming up. Coming up, these trees were just harvested and cut back. We're gonna go ahead and let these grow all the way out for the rest of the summertime. They're gonna get huge. They're gonna get drumsticks on them. They're restructurizing right now, just on the comeback. And this is what happens just about after, you know, a week from harvesting. I know I just went through a bunch of things there. Just wanted to get a new video out, let you guys know that everything is well. We're keeping up with orders. We have lots and lots of orders coming in right now. Capsules, powder, uh, powder loose leaf, and even a 10 free trees with starter kit, starter box option at moringagrowerscoop.org if you wanna get started growing trees, get you a packet of starter seeds with some trees and some products that we make by hand. It's beautiful out here. Love it, love the orchard. I'm Kendrick Henry, the founder of the Moringa Growers Co-op and would love for you to contact me at moringagrowerscoop.org. We just got a new phone number, 813 one six six two sixty and that's our new moringa growers co-op phone number it's on the website we're redeveloping the website right now making some changes if you'd like to grow moringa let us know if you'd like to purchase moringa please let us know we have it all organic super fresh and super local right now mostly everything is coming out of the tampa bay area st petersburg fort uh fort lauderdale miami everything's pretty much coming from florida right now uh and all organically grown certified by the Moringa Growers Co-op. This one I just cut back uh, the other day. So it's just just now starting to come back. And uh, let me know. I'm Kendrick Henry, would love to hear from you. 813-616-6260. And you can call or text that number anytime to reach me. Peace, love, prosperous growing, and I'll see you next time. Ciao.